Well, welcome back to The Witness. I am your humble host, Spoons Asunder. And as I'm staring at this guy, I do have more energy today. I'm, I'm guessing that the last episode turned out to be a little slow because I was very low on energy when I recorded that. Some days are like that. I just push myself a little too much, so I apologize if it's not as entertaining as it should have been. Oh, but I got more energy today, and I'm starting this one off afresh. So... There's a bunch of puzzles here, and I'm sure I can figure out at least one of them, hopefully. I also think I might be able to actually solve the one on the door with the dots and the, the split and the dots like the dominoes, um, but I still don't know which end to lead it towards, so that's the only thing. Maybe it's just all of them and it's simpler than it looks. I don't know, but a lot of these... This one I can do. This one's just nothing, right? Um, okay. How am I supposed to know the correct path? Well, fine. Um, this looks precarious. Huh. Okay. I guess it's a weight that will lower the ladder. I, I can't just pull this. No. Oh well. So many puzzles. It's a little cryptic as to which ones you're supposed to do first. So it's basically just wander around until you find the right one. Like this one looks doable, but I bet it's one of those where it has to have a certain path. Yep, and that wasn't the path. And how am I supposed to know which path it is? Oh, there's another humming obelisk here. He's got to be uh, useful for something, probably later in the game. But I can't do anything with him now. Oh, there's a lonely little flower in this fireplace. I don't know why that's so pretty to me, but it's pretty. It's metaphorical. This one on? Yeah, no. This one on? No. I'm guessing the goal is to get into this door in the big central tower because there's so many wires coming off of it, but as to how to solve all of those to unlock it, it's a little less clear. Unlike this water, which is extremely clear. That's just gorgeous. I like those. They really boosted like all the colors just to make this look extremely vibrant throughout the whole game and it works. Sets the atmosphere, makes it a little less uh, troublesome when, when you don't know where to go. I can even walk all the way over here. Where am I supposed to go? Into the castle I guess? That's, that's, that's strange. I feel like I'm missing a lot, but also it seems like this game is designed to make you wander around everywhere before you even figure out the next step where to go. This is amazing itself. It's a puzzle of just movement. Huh. That works, I guess. It's not a very tough one. Can I solve this? Does it just not matter? Or is this the path that I took through the maze? Because I think it was like that. No. Like that. It was like that. I was close. Okay. So maybe those other ones that didn't have a, a marked pathway were some sort of movement path like that as well. It just wasn't a very clear maze for it. There's the next one. Oh, this is going to be tedious. I'm probably going to have to remember where I went for this one, so... This way. This way. This way. This way. This way. 
I'm betting this won't be as yeah, that's gonna suck. <sighs> Is it just like this? No. Well, let's see. I can just go here and then over to this wall and then up. So is it just do that? Okay. I'm also not sure if it remembers the path that I took recently to get back here or if it's uh, the path that I took first. Because there are several different ways to go through this one. And it doesn't appear to be marked as to which the way is correct, unless it's grass somehow. Is the grass like a barrier? I bet that's it. Grasses are invisible barriers. I'm going to treat it like that and see if I can get any farther. So it would be like that. Is this is this the right track then? If it goes like this, it is. Okay. That that was a nifty little trick. These grasses were barriers, even though they weren't to my feet, they were to the maze. So that was clever. Hmm. I'm up on the walls now. Why am I up on the walls? There's nothing here, except for buckets of. That, that's vaguely person-shaped, and I don't like that. That's extremely creepy. Uh, okay, I'm going to move on. Anything on this side? No. Okay, no point in coming up on these walls. Next maze, I guess. So, I can sort of see it from here. I'm just going to, just going to... I don't see any invisible... Barriers in this one. Is it just going to be simple? That would be nice. No. Okay, let's look around. I'm thinking it has something to do with the sound, because my footsteps sound different here than they do here. See, and then there's barriers. Gotta be footsteps, so it's wherever is not soggy. Is that it? So that's a soggy one. Nope. Nope. Okay. Okay. See if I can remember that. I think the path was this, 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 this. It was. They're getting inventive with these. Just the slight difference in the sound of your footsteps uh, matters a lot, I guess. Okay, so I think I have one more. This one. Alright, what's this one going to be? I don't know. There might be a slight sound if I pass the wrong way. Yeah, that. A little crunch. I'm not sure though. I'm just going to try one. Something about the color? I mean, there, there's oranges here. Does that mean something? It probably means something. Some of these are orangey and others aren't. So I think I need to follow the oranges because this is unavoidable. So I'm going to go here. And then... Yeah, here. A little odd. I think that's the path I tried first. Yeah, that doesn't work. 
Is it that? It is that. I don't know why it was that path. It was this way. The only path I hadn't taken. So I don't think it was the sounds, because I did those sounds either way. And there was still some of the orange stuff, like here. So I don't think it was those either. Oh, were some of these rounded? That's probably what it was. Some of the corners are rounded. Like this. The shrubs. And some of them were not. Maybe? I think that's the only one that was rounded. <laughs> Never mind. I'm clueless about this one. But it's open, so... That's, that's fine by me. I don't know why I needed to do all those. Like, okay, this door opens something. I guess I'll get out of this, this maze like this. And where do they all go? Did they just go to the next one? Yeah, these are just connected with each other. I mean, it makes it easier to get around. Was it unlocking down here? Is it, that's how I got in. I don't know why I needed to do any of those. It didn't seem to unlock anything further. Hmm. There's another statue, people. Don't murder him. That's not nice. Oh, they're just sparring. It's, maybe they're not just sparring and knocked his helmet off. Well, her, maybe. Hard to tell with statues. Okay. A bunch of them. Hello. Mr. Guitar Player. That looks strangely modern. Can I have this? I boasted among men that I had known you. They see your pictures in all works of mine. They come and ask me, who is he? I know not how to answer them. I say, indeed, I cannot tell. They blame me, and they go away in scorn. And you sit there, smiling. I put my tales of you into lasting songs. The secret gushes out from my heart. They come and ask me, tell me all your meanings. I know not how to answer them. I say, ah, who knows what they mean? They smile and go away in utter scorn. And you sit there smiling. Rabindranath Tagore, 1910. Okay, that was a very strange and cryptic poem that I don't believe means anything. Because I can't gather any meaning from that. Uh, what are you admiring? A ring? Is that, yeah, that's, that's that's a ring. These are weird. Is there any point to this, or is it just wandering around in strange environments? They did find some interesting characters, and he has a sword, of course, and a business suit. They're mixing eras. This is, this is not right. And there's others back there. Hmm. Not bad. Uh, what did I do? Well, I already started. Ew. I was turning these on as I as I stood on them. Is this the reset? Probably. Good. Okay, so start point here. Figure it's probably easier to figure it out here and then solve it. There's not one solution, I could go either way. So I'm gonna go this way. I already screwed it up. Too far. Yep, like that. And then like this, and this, and this. And... Nope, that doesn't work. Maybe there is one solution. Should have gone with my original one. Go up here. And then this is one of the dots. And I can come back 
here. And down here to hit the other dot that was there. And then I should be able to go back up. Like this. And I don't remember where the end point was though. There. Just like this. There we go. Cool. Hello, friends. And there's another one. So, let me just turn that on so I can see it. This is the split one. I, I just need to go down the middle, right? I can't. It doesn't show all of the grid here. Okay. This is broken. How do I split it if this is broken? That that doesn't work. I need that one. Don't I? I don't need this one. This one. Yep, I needed that one. It's a lot of broken ones. That's odd. Tempted to go back there. But I want to solve this first. But it's the second half because I don't think the order matters. That should be. Nope. That was not right. I forgot to split either one. What was I even thinking? I don't know if this works or not. They might yell at me for splitting the blacks too. I'll find out. Yeah, I don't know if I'm allowed to do uh, this to split the blacks as well. Oh well, I'll just start over anyway. Like this? No? What did I do wrong? I didn't touch that one. Does this black ink mean something? Maybe that's another black one that I would have to split, but... Like, there's no reason to use that one. Because it was by the black ones anyway. Hmm. I don't know. I think this should work, but it isn't. Now, why doesn't this work? That's the thing, because I thought all you had to do was split the black and the white. Or else I'm forgetting things. And if that black square was a square, then uh, it would be right here, which I would think wouldn't matter unless I'm not allowed to split these blacks. I guess I can assume that and uh, try not to split it. Or does that mean that it's one of the black dots and it has to be covered? That's probably more likely. So if I go this way... Is that gonna work then? No? Why? The pattern should be fine. I don't get it. Well, I guess I'll look over here. See if there's anything enlightening. Or if there's nothing at all. There's more. Ooh. That's some weird looking sand down there. Strange. You seem to be able to go pretty much anywhere. Another random couch out here. Again, really good spot, but why is it here? Yeah, but you seem to be able to just wander at will, regardless of whether you've solved the puzzle in most of the places. So that makes actual progress progression a lot less clear as to what you're supposed to do or where you're supposed to go, because you can go anywhere. And I'm, I'm a fan of open world games, but Open world does not work very well in a puzzle game. 
because then it just makes it seem tedious and uh, pointless. And now I'm exploring a, a broken ship for some reason. Why am I here? It's cool and all, but uh, why am I here? Okay, guess I'm going inside. There's still, oh, there's another voice thing. Those are weird. A ship owner was about to send to sea an emigrant ship. He knew that she was old and not well built at the first, that she had seen many seas and climes and often had needed repairs. Doubts had been suggested to him that possibly she was not seaworthy. These doubts preyed upon his mind and made him unhappy. He thought that perhaps he ought to have her thoroughly overhauled and refitted, even though this should put him at great expense. Before the ship sailed, however, he succeeded in overcoming these melancholy reflections. He said to himself that she had gone safely through so many voyages and weathered so many storms that it was idle to suppose she would not come safely home from this trip also. He would put his trust in Providence, which could hardly fail to protect all these unhappy families that were leaving their fatherland to seek for better times elsewhere. He would dismiss from his mind all ungenerous suspicions about the honesty of builders and contractors. In such ways, he acquired a sincere and comfortable conviction that his vessel was thoroughly safe and seaworthy. He watched her departure with a light heart and benevolent wishes for the success of the exiles in their strange new home that was to be. And he got his insurance money when she went down in mid-ocean and told no tales. What shall we say of him? Surely this, that he was verily guilty of the death of those families. It is admitted that he did sincerely believe in the soundness of his ship, but the sincerity of his conviction can in no wise help him, because he had no right to believe on such evidence as was before him. He had acquired his belief not by honestly earning it in patient investigation, but by stifling his doubts. And although in the end he may have felt so sure about it that he could not think otherwise, yet inasmuch as he had knowingly and willingly worked himself into that frame of mind, he must be held responsible for it. William K. Clifford, 1874. Okay, so I'm kind of losing faith in this game, to be honest. It seems like it's trying too hard to be philosophical, and it's becoming extremely open-ended and uh, complex just for the sake of com complexity without explaining uh, as much as it should in my mind. So I can continue playing this if people want to see it, but I would imagine that it's starting to get a little, a little boring to watch because admittedly it's getting a little boring to play. So that's a sad realization because it's such a pretty game and I would want, I really wanted to like this, but to be honest, I'm, I'm really not sure where it's going, if anywhere. And those those voice logs, I mean, they're they're philosophical in a way, but they're just uh, they're not doing it for me. So let me know if you want to see more of this game in the comments. But like, look at this puzzle. I have no idea what any of these symbols mean. I've seen the black one once, but then there's a smaller one. So uh, this this just is uh, starting to not make sense. So. If you want to see more, big for it in the comments. Otherwise, I will probably not play more of this game. I did enjoy the beginning of it, and then it, and then it just uh, took it too far. Many thanks for watching this video, and until next time, may you experience a